one call, that's all. Okay, I'm not a lawyer, but if you're anywhere in the Midwest, then you know who I'm talking about. That guy's got millions of commercials everywhere across everywhere, every platform. Um, I guess he's really like that in real life. I guess he's a nice person. Um, so what? What? So lawyer talk, okay? This particular video is going to be labeled um, "Claim for Damages, Injuries, or Death." So. Now this is not legal advice because I'm not a lawyer. Um, some people say a liar, that's you. This is for those people who have been wronged, damaged, debted, suffered death at the hands of a federal officer, okay? Now, I'm not saying that every situation applies. I can't tell you if yours does or doesn't. You have to know what was going on with you and your situation but you can file a claim against them and in some cases um, there are financial sums associated with that so in this particular video i'm not going to like break down every single thing because it will take too long and i'm not trying to provide all that advice i do recommend you you know do your own research and find somebody who might even be versed in it but to get yourself going um, so this particular information is on the gsa website okay so what you want to do is type in um, claim, damage, injury, the word or, death, and then type in GSA, okay? Once you do, do that, okay, Google will take you to the gsa.gov website where then forward slash, it's forms, dash library forward slash claim dash damage dash injury dash or dash death and you'll be able to pull up this form right here okay it comes in a PDF you download this PDF and it's gonna step you through what officer what agency what time all the descriptions etc etc and then from there on the same site you can get a lot of their information about um, basically where to file who to file it with etc etc now I don't have it prepped on here but I know in one of the um, legal sections I've seen that even the government has already established financial um, sums that are utilized for your particular type of injury death or um, loss whatever else damage they maybe they mess up your car or whatever else you can file that claim through this paperwork through this site and send it in and get compensated now make sure that it's legitimate don't go out here using using this for nefarious purposes um, because they will turn that back on you and they got a hot a whole ahead of a lot more time and the money than you got all right so be legit on it be legit be oh never mind um, when you do this, okay, take it seriously, people, like, use your, use your brain, all right, um, because frivolous information and claims can get you busted right in the butt, you can bust your butt, so, this is where you get it from, now, as far as the, uh, financial fees and sums, it might be on the form, um, most of the stuff I seen, I mean, they were, on the low end, most of them were talking about 50000 a quarter million dollar, you know for this that and the other so if you're gonna look if you're gonna google how much I mean put down what you feel first of all is the damage price and and don't be shy to make it juicy okay but make it within reason you know you're gonna wanna look up um, uh, financial sums for say like um, Comp or compensation for uh, federal agent um, deprivation of rights. Okay, like there, I think it's under fee schedule or something like that. So I apologize for not having that up. If I would have thought about it at the time, I would have popped it up. Um, but this is where you get the form. And because keep in mind, like, say you put like $250,000 for personal injury, all right? That might be exactly what they're willing to pay out. But the judge, 
you know, they might look at it and say, that's, that's too much, we only allow for this. But you can still argue out the fact that, hey, no, my medical bills were over this amount. This is the pain, this is the suffering, this is the loved one's life they took, this is what they were worth, this is what the income was, they damaged my car, my car earned me $50,000, this was embarrassment. Um, add all that up, okay, come up with your lump sums, like I said, and put it on there. Okay, so you can fight back where it's warranted. All right, so once again, this is on the GSA, so the General uh, Services Administration, which is where they issue all their forms and whatever else, all the legal stuff that they recognize. So using their stuff, that's how you get recognized. And this is in their forms library under claim, damage, injury, or death. It's a PDF. It's a 577KB, so it ain't nothing to download. Get it, read it, use it. All right, guys, that's about it. Not a terribly long video, just bringing you guys more stuff to know as a U.S. national. Because, um, like I said, they don't really like when I come around and deal with stuff. So, for the most part, they leave me alone. Um, because I don't want to deal with them, they don't want to deal with me. And being that we're U.S. nationals, when you conduct yourself appropriately... You won't have most of these issues, but if the moment arises, you need to be prepared. So, for those people who keep asking me what do I have in my binder, when I give a cop, like the few times I've had to run into them, which is like less than three, that this is what is going to go in there. That's, I, I'm going to put that form in there. So they know when they're reading through, trying to figure out who I am, say so they want to overstep. Oh, no, 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 good sir. Here's my binder. This explains everything, all the questions you want to ask me. This is it. Legally, I know I don't have to answer any of your questions. It's all in my binder. I was instructed by my lawyer not to say anything other than the exact information I'm telling you now. And here, here is my binder. And then if you've watched my binder video, you know that at the bottom it says on there, uh, by accepting this, you agree that I am a U.S. national. I'm, not, um, I'm reserving all of my rights. I am, you know, blah, 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 and I book out at, you know, $900 an hour. Anything past 20 minutes to interview me, this is what it is. They, they're they holding it, they've accepted it, and when I go to court, that's what I'm, I bring, you know what I mean? So, you put all your tidbits in there, put everything in there. Even like in the last video when I was talking about my cousin, Courtney, um, he's got a binder and he's got all his stuff stamped, dated, judges, everything, all signed off on his too. And this is something that we never even talked about. We haven't even seen each other in God knows how many years. We get together, and all of a sudden, we got matching information. So that just goes to show, like minds are doing these things the right way, not just jumping in the vehicle, traveling, and being all like, uh, uh, I'm doing my thing. Know what I mean? All right, so, uh, yeah, be smart. Be smart. Black, white, Puerto Rican, Mexican, others, whatever. I don't care what color, race, creed, nationality, sexual orientation you come from. Be smart. Because these people ain't playing. They carry a gun in their hip. All right? They get you in that courtroom, they going to sock you financially or throw you in the, in the hoose cow. So to prevent all that, do your research. I know everybody wants to hurry up and get, I want to travel. I want to do this. I want to be able to. It's coming. It's coming. You didn't took a whole lot of your life contracting to get here. It's going to take you a minute to get out. I know freedom is... Popeye's chicken sandwich tasting good. Just chill out. Do the research. As always, watch my videos. I know there's a lot of videos. I had one guy so dedicated that he was like, bro, I just came across your site, like, I think he said, like, three weeks ago, maybe four weeks ago. And he was like, you have fire information on here. I appreciate it. All your videos are good. I get it. I was like, oh, you just came across it? I was like, what do you mean, all of them? He's like, he's like, I have done nothing but watch every single video. I was like, well, damn, thanks. That's what people are supposed to do. He was knowledgeable. He had everything. Just needed a little uh, consultation. You know, I booked out for the hour, and uh, we iced it. So everything is good, good to go. Everybody's been successful in their travels. I just want you guys to be as successful as I am and as successful as possible when dealing with this. A lot of people make these videos, and they don't walk the walk. They don't live this way, okay? They don't care if you get whomped up in your car for doing something dumb or whatever else. I'm trying to help prevent all that from there. Have a positive interaction between law, law enforcement officers or your Leos, you know, 
because there, because these days we don't have peace officers anymore. Okay, they're law enforcement officers. The colors have changed. The attitudes have changed. They're hiring people who are, um, well, I won't go into all detail, but well, let's just say some of them are militarized. Some of them are preconditioned to just taking orders, and they don't know the laws and things. They're just told to go out and do these things. Some are good with it, and some ain't. But once they know what jurisdiction you're in, you've identified yourself as a foreign national, um, you have your everything is up to par, you're good. They, they can't process you like a U.S. citizen because you're not. U.S. citizen is their jurisdiction. Somebody come in your house, you can tell them to take your feet off the coffee table. Same, same thing. All right. Um, so that's pretty much about it, guys. Don't forget to hit that bell, like, subscribe. I'm going to get out of here. i got some more videos to make. I'm going to try to enjoy some of this weather. Um, stay healthy. Support the channel. Don't forget to support... Um, uh, blackside32.com which is me and I guess that's about it more info to come because um, we'd be finding out new stuff every day so talk to you guys later